In this video, I'm gonna show you the exact settings you need to know in order to export your videos with a transparent background. Stick around. Tyler here from Video Editing with Tyler White. And if you wanna learn how to edit video like a pro, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. Inside Premiere Pro, I have text and I also have an object. And it's important to note that these settings that I'm about to show you are for anything that you would like to export with a transparent background. And for the sake of this tutorial, I'm gonna export both so you can see it works for anything. I'll start off by getting rid of this beach background and then that just leaves the object and the text on the timeline. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the very beginning of the timeline and I'm gonna press I on the keyboard for in. Then I'll go to the very end of the footage and I'm gonna press O on the keyboard for out. That's gonna create in and out points for what I want to render. Then I'm gonna go up to file, export media. I'll start off by changing the format down to QuickTime and it's important to note that if you don't change it to QuickTime, this won't actually work. I'm gonna leave preset the way that it is because this is gonna to change to custom as we go through the different settings. Then go down to output name and this is gonna be what you name your clip and where you decide to save it. So I'm gonna name this transparent background just click save next make sure that export video and export audio are both checked that way they're both included in the export then scroll down to video codec change this to animation and the video codec has to be animation if it's not this will not work next scroll down to basic video settings and you can click match source or you can manually input what your video is supposed to be so i'm going to unlink this and i'm going to type in 1920 by 1080. Then I'm just gonna scroll down. Frame rate, you can change this to whatever you want it to be. Field order should be progressive. Aspect should be square pixels 1.0 and then make sure that you have render at maximum depth checked. Then under depth, you need to make sure that you select eight plus alpha. And this is the setting that you need in order for the video to export with a transparent background. Then under advanced settings, all this you can leave the same. And if you have audio included, then go over to audio, select that, and just change the basic audio settings to the sample rate at 48,000 and the sample size to 16 bit. And don't forget to check use maximum render quality and just click export. Now that that's exported, I'll just drag that into Premiere and show you that it actually works. I'm gonna delete this, just drag it onto the timeline. Then I'll throw that beach background back on there. As you can see, the text and the object are both on a transparent background because once I turn the background back on, it's just the object and the text included in the video. Continue to perfect your skills by checking out this video. Edit like a pro by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. I'll see you in the next video.